Good morning. Uh, it's currently quarter past five, Sunday morning, and um, this is one hell of a contrast in comparison to last week. I'm currently wearing jeans and a hoodie, whereas last week it was shorts and a t-shirt at this time in the morning, or a shirt, like a really horrible Primark shirt. But I'm going to grab some coffee. Uh, great, great. There's no money in the ATM. We now have cash. It is time to hit the road with my bloody coffee. I can't get the belt to go. How much are they a piece? Uh, 50p each. Okay, cool. I've got Order of the Phoenix. Yeah, so I do as well. Sorry, you leave out here. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, start a little pile going. Yeah. If I just pay for these ones, I'll be sure. back in a bit. Yep. Lovely, thank you. No How much are the Dragon Ball Z DVDs, mate? Uh, oh, 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 too fair. I have a 50 for them. Oh, okay. They're pretty much all No worries, thank you. First one I picked up, missing a disc. Which means he's not put it all the way properly. It's 150 quid, if you're having a laugh. So, I didn't have time to get the camera out, but I've just bought this JVC amplifier, JAS11. I paid 20 pound. Very, very quick look online. We're looking at about 110 plus shipping. Oh. That did not quite go to plan, someone behind me. Looks like that at the front. So, literally saw someone carrying it. So all I saw was the backside, like this. And so, oh, can I have a look? I literally just bought, uh, literally just got it before someone who deals in media. Like, and then not five minutes later, he appeared at the table. So, right place, right time. Please. They're te te 10 pounds. 10 pound 10 each. 10 pounds a pair, because that's what you know there. They're de yeah, they're decent boots. They are. Uh, my other half just sort of went a bit bananas over the years. And he knew somebody that used to sell them. Oh, okay. Would you do I 30 quid for all four pairs? Yeah. That's an easy one. That's your yeah. pitch feedback yeah, and then the some. I don't want to take them home, so, you know, they can go. <laughs> Who's in charge of the money? I want to put it in the box. That's all right. Lovely, Lovely, thank you. Thank you. Uh, do you want the bag? If you can, that'd be amazing. Yeah, I've got others. Who's, please? It's a number seven, they just... And how much are the, the loose ones? Three. Three. Need thick socks though. Sorry? Thick socks to wear them. Yes. Yeah. So they should be all right for size. I should have put those into a bag, okay, but I'm not running away with them. Okay, just so no one else takes them. I'll put the, those ones in there as well. Do you know how much these were at all? Oh, she's... Oh, she's in charge. Okay. <laughs> right. now we're on 23 inside the bag. Oh, this is 20, 10 pounds. Oh, sorry. Five pound each. So 23 and 33. 33. Have you got any more toast coming out at all? Yes. Okay, I'll... I'll, I'll have no, that, that's fine. I'll hang around. Would you like your hangers back? 
yes, okay. please, that, no. that, that's just fine. Yeah, no, <laughs> you know what, I said to myself, I'm not gonna buy a lot today. And then today happened. <laughs> so, in no particular order, three pound for a 60th anniversary edition of Monopoly. It's about 40, 50 pounds as far as I'm aware. A relatively uncommon Spider-Man uh, PS2 game. I paid a pound, it's about 11 or 12 pound all in. A case only of Super Mario 64 paid a quid because I'm fairly certain I've got a, a cart only to get rid of now this was a bit of a fail and um, if I'd have taken just 10 seconds to look I would have realized that it's a fake um, but here we have polo Ralph Lauren and um, it also says it's cashmere and it's really not <laughs> so that was two pound well spent uh, 20 pound on this JVC I did look it up online and I think it's worth well over triple figures. I think it's about 120, but it is the JVC JAS11. So that's quite nice. That will be sold on. A little something for myself. And we do have the Chemical Brothers come with us. As I say, I only pick up um, records for personal use, I won't do it to resell. This is for me because we are getting the gardens done uh, within the next two weeks, I think. Uh, and we need to water it several times a day. So that's the lazy man's way of dealing with it. Uh, we've done that. We've done that. We've got four pairs of Mammoth Gore-Tex boots. As you can see from the back here, I don't know how well it's gonna pick up on the GoPro, but this, you can see it's barely been worn. Um, you're looking at anywhere between 30 and 50 pounds a pair for these. We've got a Bose Companion 3 I paid 30 pounds for. Uh, this is actually going to replace my speaker system that I'm currently using on my desktop. Uh, I could resell it for about 100 pounds. Uh, brand new, I think they're about 2 250 So absolute bargain. Now to go into one of the side doors side door number one we've got three lots of three doodler starts i've had these before um that i can normally get about 30 to 50 pounds on these uh, we've also got some face paint just to you know make life interesting when you've got a two-year-old and make it really messy we've got cards against humanity we've got some lego and we've got some harry potter books harry potter books were 50 pence each so we've got the half-blood prince order of the phoenix uh half blood prince goblet of fire and deathly hallows so two of the black book versions and three of the bloomsbury versions and now we move on to the best pickup of the day by far so i think yeah shoes were fiber now joseph chinis they're good toast is good joseph T chini x toast is good so these are pre-owned in the box and even better see that it's got the code it's got the size it's got the color it's got the price i reckon i'll get triple figures for those very very easily now these are not so good because they say paleo suede they're not suede uh, now these do have a very horrible gum um sole but you can see that they are once again in very very good condition um, again chini and toast they would have been between two and three hundred pounds brand new <laughs> absolute bargain uh, five pound for some hobbs lady shoes uh, it's not going to be mega money i might stick them out at like 20 quid just to get rid of them to be honest uh, we've got some timberlands paid four pounds for those again ladies good condition very very happy indeed um Oh, oh, I didn't know I had these. But these are Joseph Chinis. Oh, these might be, hang on. Push just soul made. Is this potentially, because these feel suede -y. Oh, hang on. Seven and a half, black paleo suede. They're black. Um, it says Colette. Colette, 
This video is unofficially sponsored by The Hut Group. They sell everything from clothing to kitchenware to cleaning products. Click on the link below and buy something. But there we go, that has been a very nice surprise. Does it have a price on it? No, 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 and no. Okay, either way, they're like triple figures once again. Absolutely, absolute madness. I know that I, it, was, it was carnage. I think I stopped recording at one point because there was just so many people there. Here we have a toast t-shirt, paid five pounds. Here we have a Lyle and Scott Scotland, 100% lambswool scarf, paid three pounds. Here we have a toast dress, paid five pounds. Toast shirt paid five pounds. Now, Toast is um, is apparently a very good brand, so I'm very happy indeed. Someone said it at the store. I was like, "Is it?" And it, like, yeah, it is. I have been told before, but uh, my memory's terrible, and I hate selling clothes. You wouldn't think it, would you? Hobbs, uh, nice bright white jeans. I paid a fiver. I, I could reckon I could sell these for about twenty pounds plus shipping. Just knock it out cheap then here we have that's my hoodie uh what else do we have well this is quite nice this is another toast this is nice and thick it is 100 percent cotton look at that absolute beaut again 30 to 50 pounds i would imagine take all of my estimations of value um as complete hogwash because it is going to depend on the style, etc. Toast. That was five pounds. And I think this might be the last item. I know this was a tenner, because it is a coat. But it is, once again, Toast. Good quality brand. It should hopefully sell itself. I've got a lot of listing to do. So, little car tour of me just sitting in the front, I suppose. Uh, a new phone is, I do have it. I'm waiting for a an Otterbox phone holder because I refuse to use phones unless they're in Otterboxes. Um, but this is the RAV4 from 2016. So because it is slightly older, it means that tax a year is 30 quid. Absolutely beautiful. It's not as good on the miles per gallon as what the CHR was, but as you can see, it's a lot bigger. So this is in the seat in position it would be in. If there was a car seat here, look at the glare on that. That's terrible. Uh, so with it being in the right position, there's still loads of leg room. We've got heated seats, which is lovely. We've got electric vehicle mode, eco mode, and sports mode. I've used all three, and it does have a bit of a kick to it for a heavier vehicle. Uh, it's stayed with charge in it. And bear in mind, I got here at 5.45, and it's now almost 9.45. Uh, it's done all right but yeah it's a it's a lovely little car it's a lovely big car if we can utilize this for potentially a good few years i'd i'd love to get a fully electric one but we just can't justify it and or afford it to be fair uh, i think to get a fully electric you're looking at about 50 grand um but depending on what mileage you do you end up breaking even after a couple of years because obviously the like a full tank as it were is like 10 pence rather than i think it's about 80 quid on this so it is nice i think next i would like a i would like a plug-in hybrid because again it just dramatically increases your miles per gallon but it, it's a nice vehicle we've only had it for god four days five days i think uh, we've only used it, well, I've used it to come here. I've used it to pick up my daughter. The wife's gone to the zoo in it. We've not really gone much elsewhere. Um, but yeah, the miles per gallon is nowhere near as good as a CHR. But it's a slightly older vehicle, um, but it's a lot bigger inside. I am going to go home. I'm going to grab some food on the way. And as I said before, I need to do some listing.